I am in love with my new solar oven. It's the third one I've had and the first one I like, and I'm gonna tell you all about it in this video. Hey everybody, it's Robin with Creativity RV, and I had to tell you about my favorite new thing in the world, which is the Solovare Sport Solar Oven. This is my third solar oven. I tried one before that folded up into like a briefcase that had a tube. Um, the tube wouldn't store inside of it, it burned everything, and now I use the tube as a fireplace poker. And I also tried one of the ones that's like an aluminum bag that you can put your own cookware in, and that didn't cook anything. But now I have found this new sport cooker, and it is amazing, you can use it right out of the box. It weighs about nine pounds, and I'll show it to you here. It comes with two three-quart graniteware pots, and they get really hot, and then they're covered in enamel, and they're self-basting, so if you eat meat, it makes really great meat in there. But like you guys can see right here, first thing in the morning, I just put it outside and preheat it, and most days I use it for something. So I'm gonna show you a whole montage of stuff that I've cooked in here, but I've cooked everything from s'mores to tofu in this thing. and. It's amazing, it's like a slow cooker, um, but you can do frozen dinners in it, you can do potatoes, um, I've done chili in it, and it really does an amazing job. You can even hard boil eggs in this thing if you like eggs. You can also pasteurize water in there, and it actually comes with a gizmo that will show you when the water is safe to drink. Right now you can see it's just sitting outside preheating and it is fall out here so it's not the warmest but this is a sunny day and it's 250 degrees just sitting outside without the reflectors even on the side. So here's the deal. The thing weighs about nine pounds. It comes with a case and it has this plastic covering over it. So the actual film on the plastic helps heat up the inside of the oven and then the oven itself is insulated so it gets really hot inside and it comes with a little thermometer and so you guys can see right here just sitting outside it's 250 degrees in there and that's without putting the reflectics up so you can put these reflective panels around the outside if it's a cooler day or um, it's just not as sunny or you want it to get smoking hot in there I've gotten mine to about 350 degrees with the reflectics on the side but I don't always use those unless you know I really need the temperature to be higher so I'm gonna show you guys a whole bunch of stuff I've cooked now with how sunny it was, how hot the oven got, and how long these things took to cook. Yum, look at this. This is one of my favorite things about this solar oven. This frozen veggie lasagna is all crusty and brown and bubbly. I don't know if you guys can see the steam coming off of that, but I could literally smell this when I was walking up 
to the solar oven. It looks really good. So it stayed about 325 in here. It was in here for about an hour. Oh, look though. It's all brown. Yum. You wanna try something? Okay, let's take a look at what that chicken and potato barbecue stuff looks like. Wow. I don't know if you guys can see this on camera, but there is just steam rising off of this. And the potatoes are cooked perfectly. Yum, I'm gonna make a taco. I was concerned that the solar oven would be hard to store, but it actually fits for me in one of my side bins. And it's a little bulkier than a lot of stuff I carry on the road, but for me, it's totally worth it because I can cook just about anything in there. So I can roast vegetables in here. I can bake bread. I'm gonna show you guys that in some coming videos. But for now, I just wanted to show you this thing. It is my favorite thing on the road. I don't have to heat up the inside of my RV now to bake things. You guys know that I was baking things on top of my propane stove, which is great. But when it gets hot in the summer, I would prefer to do all of that cooking outside. And the solar oven lets me do that. So of course, again, the link to the oven is below if you wanna check it out. Um, please give me a like on this video. Tell me if you've used it or if you have another solar oven that you like in the comments below and if you haven't subscribed please do so i wish you all happy travels out there and be free mm -hmm.